Hello, everyone. Welcome to English Book Two. We will cover Unit Seventeen today. 大家好，欢迎收看英文二的第十七课。I'm Michelle Guo, Guo Xiaoqing. The guest speaker for this unit is again Mr. Jerry Johnson. 首先介绍这一讲的特别来宾，杰瑞·强森老师。Hello, Jerry. Welcome. How are you today? Hi, Michelle. I'm fine, thank you. Excellent. Um, Jerry, you are originally from Canada. Canada and the United States are in the same North American continent, and people from Canada and America both speak English, so some of the people in Taiwan think that two countries are very similar. Do you think there are any big differences between the two countries? Well, yes. One thing is,、um, even though Canada is a much larger country,、uh, we have、uh, fewer people than in the United States. So we have about 35 million people in Canada, whereas the U.S. has 10 times that amount. So、wow. maybe in terms of population, we have more in common with Taiwan.、Mm, that's right. Taiwan has、uh, 23.5 million people. However, Canada is a lot larger, though. Yes. 呃，刚刚强森老师呢有提到，就是呃，其实加拿大跟美国非常的呃相近哦。就很多人可能以为，哎，加拿大的人跟美国人差不多。事实上，强森老师说，嗯。两个国家很大的不同就是加拿大的人口呢，远少于美国的人口。加拿大人口只有差不多三千呃五百多万，反而是跟台湾在人口方面跟台湾比较像。This unit, we are actually going to talk about your home country, okay? Canada. Would you please read the first paragraph for us? I'd love to. Thank you. Okay. Many tourists want to go to Vancouver when they think about traveling to British Columbia, the westernmost province of Canada. Although Vancouver is not the capital of BC, the capital is the smaller city of Victoria. It is Western Canada's most populous city and Canada's third largest city, with a population of just over two million people. Thank you. Let's take a look at the sentences in this paragraph. Many tourists. Want to go to Vancouver when they think about traveling to British Columbia, BC, the westernmost province of Canada. 一想到要去加拿大西边的不列颠哥伦比亚省去旅游的话呢，很多旅客就会想到，哎，要去温哥华看一看。Think about 是啊、uh, ，想有关于什么事情，或者思考有有关于什么事。呃 ，about 是介系词，所以后面的动词呢，必须要加 ing。那这一。句里面有提到 province 是名词，是一个省或者是一个州。Although Vancouver is not the capital of BC, the capital is the smaller city of Victoria. It is Western Canada's most populous city and Canada's third largest city with a population of just over two million people. 虽然温哥华呢并不是加拿大西部不列颠哥伦比亚省的省都，省都其实是比较小一点的城市，叫做维多利亚市。但是温哥华呢，还是加拿大西部人口最多，而且拥有超过两百万人口数的加拿大第三个城市。Population 是名词，人口 ；populous 是形容词，表示人口众多的意思。The third largest city is the third largest city. Largest, 形容词的最高级呢是 large， 形容词原级 large 的最高级。好，我们来看第二段 ，paragraph two. Okay.、Uh, Vancouver is also one of the most famous cities in Canada and North America, world renowned for its spectacular North Shore mountains that overlook the city, wonderful downtown beaches. Its healthy West Coast lifestyle and cultural diversity, and a wide range of outdoor activities, Vancouver also successfully hosted the 2010 Winter Olympics, and is home to five professional sports teams. In Major League Soccer, Vancouver Whitecaps of the MLS, hockey, the Vancouver Canucks, minor league baseball. The Vancouver Canadians, Canadian football, the BC Lions, and major 
League Ultimate, Vancouver Nighthawks. Thank you. Now the sentences in this paragraph. Vancouver is also one of the most famous cities in Canada and North America. 温哥华呢算是加拿大以及北美最有名的一个城市之一了. World renowned for its spectacular North Shore mountains that overlook the city. And wonderful downtown beaches, its healthy West Coast lifestyle and cultural diversity, and a wide range of outdoor activities. 它拥有世界非常知名壮观的北岸山脉,那由山上可以俯瞰城市,还有令人赞叹的市区海滩,健康的西海岸的生活步调,以及文化的多样性,还有各式各样的户外活动,outdoor activities就是户外活动。World renowned is形容词世界知名的。这句里面有一个字diversity是名词多样性。它的形容词是diverse,多样的,不同的。下一句, Vancouver also successfully hosted the 2010 Winter Olympics and is home to five professional sports teams. In Major League Soccer, Vancouver Whitecaps of the MLS, Hockey, Vancouver Canucks, Minor League Baseball, it's called Vancouver Canadians, Canadian Football, the BC Lions, and Major League Ultimate, Vancouver Nighthawks. 温哥华还成功地举办了2010年的冬季奥运会,而且有五项的 有五个职业球队的所在地,包括刚刚提到的Major League Soccer是Vancouver Whitecaps of the MLS,美国职业足球大联盟,美国职业足球大联盟的温哥华白浪队。Hockey是曲棍球,是Vancouver Canucks,温哥华的家人队。Minor League Baseball是Vancouver Canadians, uh, Canadian football, the BC Lions,是美国职棒的小联盟,温哥华加拿大人队,还有加拿大的足球联盟,北斯雄狮队,还有呢,Major uh, uh, League Ultimate,Vancouver Nighthawks,是极限飞盘的大联盟,温哥华的夜鹰队。Now, paragraph three. Okay. But more adventurous travelers tend to head into the vast wilderness of BC, which stretches 27 thousand kilometers and borders four American states. Alaska to the north and Washington, Idaho and Montana to the south. One of the jewels of BC is the small town of Hope, just a few hours drive from Vancouver along the Fraser River. There are fewer than 6,000 people living in Hope, but it is a world-class destination for river rafting, gliding, hiking, bicycle touring, and mountain biking, and hunting and fishing. Now the sentence is in paragraph 3, but more adventurous travelers tend to head into the vast wilderness of BC, which stretches 27,000 kilometers and borders four American states. 不过呢,比较喜欢冒险,就是比较有冒险性的游客呢,就会前往不列颠哥伦比亚省,绵延两万七千公里,广大浩瀚的原野,然后它的西部呢,有横跨了美国四周,包括有Alaska to the north and Washington, Idaho, and Montana to the south. 从在北边是跟阿拉斯加交界。那在南边呢,有华盛顿州,还有爱德河州,还有蒙大拿州是在加拿大的南边。One of the jewels of BC is the small town of Hope, just a few hours drive from Vancouver along the Fraser River. 不列颠哥伦比亚的一个瑰宝之一呢,就是霍普镇,一个小镇。从温哥华呢,沿着弗雷泽河呢,只要几个小时的车程就可以到了。There are fewer than 6,000 people living in Hope, but it is a world-class destination for river rafting, gliding, 
hiking, bicycle touring, mountain biking, and hunting and fishing. 虽然居住在霍普镇的人呢不到六千人，那呃、uh, ，the town of Hope， 那当然也可以音译叫呃，意、uh, 义叫希望小镇。那在这边呢，我,我称它为霍普镇。它的人口呢其实不到六千人，可是呢，它却有世界首屈一指的景点，可以泛舟啊，滑翔运动，登山、自行车的旅游，嗯，骑登山车、打猎啊，还有钓鱼。那刚刚讲的那些活动，包括有 river rafting 就是泛舟 ，gliding 是滑翔运动 ，hiking 是登山 ，bicycle touring。Mountain biking, bicycle touring, mountain biking 呢是自行车的旅游，骑登山车。那还包括有呃、um, hunting 跟 fishing 是打猎跟钓鱼。Now let's move on to paragraph four. Okay. Hope is also famous because the first Rambo movie, First Blood, starring Sylvester Stallone, was filmed there in 1982. Hope has many famous tourist sites that can be visited in one day. These include the Othello Tunnels, a series of five tunnels and two bridges, part of the original Kettle Valley Railway built in 1914, Hope Mountain and its Hope Lookout Trail, Ogilvy. Mountain, which overlooks beautiful Kakwa Lake, and Thacker Marsh, an important part of the Hope ecosystem, where salmon can be seen spawning each year. There's also the Hope Museum, where visitors can learn more about local First Nations art and culture. Now let's take a look at sentences in paragraph four. Hope is also famous because the first Rambo movie, First Blood, starring、uh, Sylvester Stallone, was filmed there in 1982. Hope 镇呢也因为在一九八二年呢第一部的兰博电影，那啊、uh, 比较也许呃、uh, 稍微年长一点的人会会记得这部电影啊，叫《第一滴血》。First Blood， 他的主演的主呃主角呢是席维斯席维斯史特龙，因为在霍普镇那边拍摄，呃，霍普镇呢更加的文明。Hope has many famous tourist sites that can be visited in one day。霍普镇呢有很多著名的观光景点，但是呢可以在一天就参观完。These include the Othello uh Othello tunnels, a series of five tunnels and two bridges. Part of the original Kettle Valley Railway built in 1914. 像是呢，呃，它的景点也包括有一个五个隧道跟两座桥的奥赛罗隧道。它建是建于一九一四年的呃水湖山谷的铁路的一部分。Hope Mountain and its Hope Lookout Trail. 啊，霍普山呢，跟它的登山步道，还有呃、uh, ，Ogilvy Mountain， which overlooks beautiful Kakawa Lake。那它啊， uh, 这边的景点还有可以俯瞰美丽、非常美丽的考卡瓦湖，还呃的欧啊奥吉尔维山脉，还有接下来是 And Thacker Marsh， an important part of the Hope。Ecosystem where salmon can be seen spawning each year. 还有呢，霍普镇很重要，它有一个很棒的生态系统，叫做啊塞克尔沼泽，好，或是塞克尔湿地。呃，每一年呢，鲑鱼呢会来到这边产卵。There is also the Hope Museum where visitors can learn more about local First Nations art and culture. 霍普镇呢，还有一间呃霍普镇的博物馆，游客呢可以在那边学到呃当地原住民的一些呃艺术与文化。Wow, there's a lot in uh the in the west part of Canada that we can visit. There sure is. Let's take a look at some vocabulary from this unit. Would you please read the word and the sentence、uh, for us? Sure. Okay,、uh, westernmost. 形容词最西端，最西的。Guosheng Lighthouse is on the westernmost tip of Taiwan's main island. Guosheng 灯塔呢是位于台湾本岛最西端的灯塔。Spectacular. 形容词壮观的，堂皇的。The fireworks on New Year's Day 
were spectacular. West Coast lifestyle. 名词指的是西海岸的生活方式或生活步调. He enjoys skiing, sailing, and the relaxed West Coast lifestyle of Vancouver. 他非常享受滑雪航行,还有温哥华那种很惬意的西海岸生活方式. Diversity. 名词差异,不同,就是多样性. Different cultures have their own diversities. 不同文化呢,都有他们自己的一个多样性. Host. 担任主人,做东,或是主持人. She hosted Gail's farewell party at her house. 他呢,在自个家举办了一位女士,盖尔女士的一个欢盛会. Ultimate. Ultimate,指名词,只是终极飞盘,或是终极飞盘的一个比赛,那它还有另外一个意思,就是最终的,最后的意思。He used to play soccer in high school, now he plays ultimate. 他以前在高中的时候是踢足球,但是现在他玩的是终极飞盘。Adventurous。形容词,冒险的,有冒险精神的。my father is very adventurous. He likes to travel to a different country each year. 我的父亲呢,非常具有冒险家的精神,他喜欢呢,每一年都去不同的国家旅游。Wilderness. 名词,荒野,野外。When he was a boy, Scout Bill used to camp out in the wilderness in the summer. 当比尔还是个童子军的时候呢,他常夏天到野外去露营。Stretch. 可以当动词或名词,伸长,伸展的意思。Students had been sitting for two hours for a lecture. They finally had a chance to take a break and stretch out. 学生呢,学生们已经听了两个小时的课了,都一直坐在那边听讲,现在终于可以起来休息一下,活动一下筋骨。Jewel. 名词,宝石,珍宝。Taiwan can be considered the jewel of Asia for its natural beauty. Gliding. He took gliding lessons during his vacation in Canada. Original. It is worthwhile to pay a visit to Louvre Museum to see the original painting of Mona Lisa. 去一趟罗浮宫呢,可以一睹蒙娜丽莎原画呢,是非常值得的。Ecosystem。名词,生态系统。It is important to preserve the delicate ecosystems found in streams and marshes. 保育溪流跟沼,就是沼泽呢,它,呃,溪流沼泽的生态系统比较脆弱,比较难维持,是非常的重要的。Preserve是保育,保留。Spawn。动词产软。We took the children to the nearby river to watch the salmon spawn. 我们带小孩呢,去附近的河边看鲑鱼产软。First Nations。First Nations 名词指的是第一首先第一个民主或是原住民原始的民主。First Nations people live in all provinces and territories across Canada. 原住民的人居住在加拿大,在加拿大的原住民就是各个省份跟地区里都有。Now after the vocabulary, let's take a look at a grammar point. Uh, which is the adjective and the superlative. 我们现在来看文法的最高级的使用方法。那我们这边有两个例句,譬如说从文章里面有 Vancouver is the third largest city in Canada. 另外一句是 Vancouver is also one of the most famous cities in North America. 这两句呢,譬如说 the third largest, 第三大, the largest, 那是最大的,那加了一个 third在中间呢,the third largest是第三大,那另外一句呢是 
the most famous cities， 指的是啊、呃、最有名的啊、呃、城市。其中呢 ，the largest 形容词是形容词 large 的最高级。我们来看看形容词最高级的用法，请看。那要注意的地方呢，形容词最高级呢，就是形容词再加上 e s t。那如果形容词呢是一、e、结尾的话，那就直接加 s t 就好了。那最高级形容词前面还要加一个冠词 the t h e。啊、uh, ，Jerry， would you please read the grammar patterns for us？ Sure. Tall, the tallest. Large, the largest. Simple. The simplest. 啊，这些都是几个加 e s t 的例子。那我们来看看第二种的用法。如果形容词两个音节，那它的结尾的字母是 y 的话呢，就要把 y 去掉，然后改成 i， 再加上 e s t。形容词前面一样，还是要加冠词的。呃、uh, ，Jerry， could you read the patterns for us? Sure. Easy, the easiest. Happy, the happiest. Lucky. The luckiest, pretty, the prettiest. 好，我们再来看形容词最高级第三种要注意的地方。第三个呢，就是一般两个音节以上的形容词前面呢，就加冠词的，然后 most 再加上形容词的原级。那这个是最简单的了。啊、uh, ，Jerry, can you read the patterns、uh, for us? Okay. Boring, the most boring. Difficult. The most difficult, incredible, the most incredible. 那这种两个音节或是两个音节以上的字加的 most 的形容词就不用改变了。第四类型呢是不规则的形容词的最高级。Jerry. Good, the best. Bad, the worst. 好，这种不规则的形容词呢，它的拼字就要特别记一下了。譬如说 ，good 就会变成 the best, bad 很呃、uh, 非常很糟糕的，最糟糕的就是 the worst。好，我们现在来看文法的练习。Let's take a look at grammar exercise. Could you read the items for us? Okay. Number one, who is a tallest or b the tallest person in your family? 真的啊，在你家里面。就是指全家来讲最高的一个呢。那因为我们最高级前面要有一个形容词，前面要有一个冠词的，所以答案应该是 B the tallest. Number two, my friend has A more, B most, or C much money than I do. 我的朋友呢，跟我的钱比较，因为只有两个人，所以只要用比较级就好了，不需要用到最高级。所以是 My friend has more money than I do. 答案是 A. Number three. Some students think Chinese is A more difficult, B the most difficult language in the world. 有些学生认为中文呢，就是跟世界其他语文比起来。的话就是跟所有的语言比，那最困难，我们要说 the most difficult， 答案是 B。Number four, the house looks a lot A good, B gooder, or C better after it has been painted。这个房子呢，看起来怎么样？就是。呃，它在被粉刷了之后，所以是跟粉刷前跟粉刷后的比较，就用比较级。那比较级好，比比原来好的比较级呢，我们用 better 就可以了。答案 C。Number five, baseball is a more popular or b the most popular sport in Taiwan. Baseball, 棒球呢，在台湾就是跟其他的运动比起来，就是跟所有的运动比起来，那就是呃，不是只有两种运动，所以我们要用最高级，就是最受欢迎的。所以答案 B, the most popular. Number six, Mr. Johnson is A, richest, B, the richest, or C, the most richest person in the world. 这一题呢？
呃，最有钱的那 rich 这个字，它原来只有一个音节，所以我们形容词很简单，加 est 就好了。那前面还有一个冠词的，所以是 the richest， 答案是 B。Now let's take a look at some other exercise. We have read about Canada. Would you like to quiz me? Okay, I think it's a good idea. Okay, great. Let's take a look at、uh, the other exercise. Okay, part one. Answering the questions. Number one, what is the capital city of British Columbia? Hmm. Uh, 哥伦呃，不列颠哥伦比亚的省都 I think it's Victoria. Good. Number two, is British Columbia a province of Canada or an American state? 不列颠哥伦比亚省呢，是加拿大还是美国的省呃的省呢？ I think it's a Canadian province. Correct. Number three, when did Vancouver host the Winter Olympics? 哪一年温哥华有主办过冬季奥运呢 ？To twenty ten. Correct. Number four, where is Vancouver located? Vancouver is located in British Columbia on the west coast of Canada. Excellent. Is that right? That's correct. Thank you. And number five, what is one activity you can do in Hope? Well, actually, I can name a few: river rafting, gliding, hiking,、uh, mountain biking, and hunting and fishing. Now let's take a look at the second exercise. Okay. Part two: matching. Match the word with its appropriate meaning. Number one, wilderness. Number two, spawn. Number three, ultimate. A, first humans to inhabit North and South America. B, natural areas not inhabited by humans. C, to lay eggs in water, e.g., fish or frogs. D. A sport played by throwing and catching a disc. 好，这一大题的第一题呢 ，wilderness 指的是野外 ，spawn 是产卵 ，ultimate 指的是终极飞盘的一个运动。那我们一、e、呢，应该要选答案，呃、uh, ，B. Natural areas not inhabited by humans. 呃、uh, ，Number two, spawn 应该选择答案 C. To lay eggs. 第三题 ，ultimate 呢是一种 sport， 所以我们答案要选 D. Number four, First Nations. Number five, adventurous. Number six, diversity. A, very exciting to look at. B, different types of things or people. C, first humans to inhabit North and South America. D. Eager to try out new experiences or activities. 呃，第四题答案我们选 C。那第五题呢是 D。第六题呢我们要选答案 B。Jerry, we have learned、uh, information about Canada in this unit, and in the next unit, Jerry is taking us to visit a small but beautiful town named Hope. Isn't it right, Jerry? That's right, Michelle. Uh, I will take you on a bicycle tour of Hope and show you some of the neat things that you can do in Hope on、that's, a summer's day. That's wonderful. I'm looking forward to it. Thank you. Goodbye.